Square. Got a little uh, MK Ultras tutorial for you here today. Um, I'm going to be teaching this move here. I can I call it the uh, continuous open hand juggle uh, for obvious reasons. So for this one, uh, you're going to want a, an MK Ultra setup that has like a decent amount of exposed cord in it. All right. Uh, this is actually like my preferred setup. I have it on on almost all of my own sets. It's a uh, it's essentially like a, a long game set with almost uh, the short game amount of beads on it or short form rather uh, amount of beads on it. So I uh, I do a double wrap when I wear it on my wrist. It has a lot of exposed cord, but but uh, it affords me just that much more flexibility and versatility when I'm doing tricks. So this is a uh, yeah I mean it's how I've ended up setting up the vast majority of my sets of uh, MK Ultras. And uh, lets me play a little bit more like Big Larry compared to like the usual short form setup or the, the more packed long form setup that, that gives you kind of uh, more bead coverage on the chord. Anyways, for this trick, uh, you're basically going to be working in this open hand style. So if you're not familiar or not comfortable with it, uh, start by doing this kind of thing. All right, I've got here my, uh, this is an eight millimeter set, which I, I really like playing. Uh, but just work on this back and forth, get the timing of that little bounce and the transfer is kind of an up down motion to get it rocking back and forth. Okay, Don't worry too much if you're getting some transfer of beads between the two packets, that's not a big deal. And it'll kind of, uh, you'll learn over time to kind of work that out and take that in stride, even make some small adjustments as you're playing, all right? So get that motion down first, and then once you've got that, uh, it's time to get into the actual trick, which is kind of a figure eight motion. And it's I like to think of it as a, a backward or kind of inside roll on the outer side, like the right side, and then the left hand side. So there's kind of this motion to the beads, all right? And so if you start in this position with roughly like the high grip, but open, uh, you're gonna be flicking the packet up towards your right shoulder. Whoop around like that and then you're going to catch it it's going to go around the back of your hand and catch it palm up on the uh, on the upswing so like this okay and then you're going to maintain that momentum these beads are going to want to whip around you're going to maintain that momentum and flip it back over towards your left shoulder and again kind of turn your turn your wrist a little bit and catch it on the upswing so like this okay so the two motions are like this and like that so Work on it uh, one by one, one side at a time. Take a beat in between each one, or even do a, an extra swing in between each one. Okay, get that swing going. Okay, and then once you're comfortable, progress to a one-two. One-two. So you notice that I'm curving, curling my wrist in like that to change the angle because it's hard to get the full figure eight motion so you're you're compensating for that by changing the angle on your wrist there a bit okay one two one two and then just like learning any other kind of juggling or lots of uh, repeat motions you just once you can get two go for three one two three okay start again one two three one two three okay and uh, just work on it little by little. You'll get it. It took me a long time actually to to figure out the timing for this when I was first developing the trick. Uh, but you see how much I'm curling my wrist in there. You'll get it eventually. And once you do, there's lots of uh, there's lots of ways to work this into your your flow. You can go back and forth different directions. I tend to do it just like you know one or two reps before moving on, so it doesn't get too repetitive. Also because it's Honestly, it's kind of hard to maintain it indefinitely, <laughs> but uh, anyways, yeah, hope you have fun with this one. It's kind of a different uh, a different feel from a lot of the other tricks, because it's open palm like that, and just like a nice little kind of work in All right, enjoy, and uh, yeah, leave your comments, let me know how it's going, or uh, 
any other tricks that you want to see requested. Alright? See ya.